Go. Well, welcome all, and welcome Mr. Barry Peatling to the Barry Peatling Sports Show. And welcome to you, Colin Sutcliffe. Uh, Sir Colin Sutcliffe. It's a very nice day in Chelsea, and uh, the all range gone, and uh, very happy to be. Yeah, it's a hot day. It's a sports show. It's we're about to, ice creams are melting. No, it's about twenty-five. Today minutes. we're going to talk about we're going to talk about this Peatling's Chelsea's best and fairest 2017. Yeah. And we're going to get, we're going to do very all the rounds. Very neutral, very neutral. Very neutral. You got your favourites? No, I didn't no. have any favourites. Oh, because the number one favourite last was Toddy Gardner. He was, he was, uh, so he was a favourite coming into the season, Toddy Gardner. Oh, he was yeah. three on. But uh, anyway, we'll, take, we'll tell, talk more about that as we get down the track. So let's um, just get in, stuck into it then, Barry. Yep. Um, first of all, we've got um, round one. Round one. Uh, Chelsea versus Edie Asp. One vote, Brad Clark. Yep. Two votes, Jason Clark. And three votes, Maddie Silver. Maddie Silver. Yes. Have you got him on the list? Yeah. There, there you go. go, Maddie Silver. Put him on the list. He makes three votes of the first game. First so game. round two. Yep. Round two. This is Chelsea versus Seaford. Yep. Okay. So one vote, Jason Clark. Jason Clark had a yes. very good season. Oh. Two votes, Jack Francis. Three okay. votes, Truey. Truey. Yep. Excellent. So that leads us into round three. Yep. And round three, I'm trying to work out who's um, playing in round three, but we've got round three anyway. Yeah, no one round is. three. Yep. One vote. Yep. Trent Styles. Trent Stiles. Stiles. Here we go, first season. Two votes, Brad Clark. And three votes, Jack Francis. Yep. So, so far, no Toddy Gardner. No, he had a bit of a try. He did, right, he did have a bit of a reasonably ordinary start this year. So that leads us to the next round. I think he missed a couple of games, too. Yeah, round four. Yep. One vote, Brad Clark. Ever consistent, as usual. Mr. Clark's pulling three games out of four. Two votes. Toddy Gardner. There he comes. Three votes, Jack Francis. Only 18 year old this kid, Colin. 18, will be a superstar. Round five, Chelsea versus the Pines. Yeah. One vote, Daly Shannon. Yep. Daly Shannon. Did he make your list? He didn't, have, didn't he even did, make your list. He didn't have a very good season last year, but he, I think he'll, he'll be alright next Two votes to Daly Shannon, right, two? No, one vote oh, to one Daly vote. Shannon. Two votes to T. Styles. Styles, Mr. Muscle Mr. Man. Mr. Styles, and three votes, Brainy. Brainy, yep. Brainy. Stuff to fire up too, I think, this time of the year. So that leads us to um, the round six game yep. um, between YCW and Chelsea, and we've got here the votes. One vote, Styles. Styles, yeah. Two votes, Daly Shannon. Yeah, he played all right the early doors. Um, average, average of two goals a game, Colin. Yeah. Daly Shannon. Goes pretty well, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, and that leads us to. Three votes. Uh, three votes is B. Clark. Bradley Clark. So that leads us to round seven. Mr. Mr. Consistency, Brad Clark is. Mr. Consistency. Yeah, that's, so that's a new word for that. But that's Mr. What, consistency. That's what he is. That leads us to round seven. Versus Lane Warren. Yeah. And that gives us the one vote. Daly Shannon. Yep. And then we've got two votes. It's got Jesse. Number 55, Jesse. Yeah, I don't, know, I don't even know his name. I don't even know his name, but he got two votes. All right, okay. And then, so that's two votes for Mr. Number 55, Jesse. Yeah, well, I'll, just, I'll just put down 55. Three votes, Todd Gardner. There we go, look out. Here he comes. So round eight. Um, one vote, Jason Clark. Two votes, Toddy Gardner. Yep. Three votes... B. Clark. Simon Mitchell hasn't polled over here. Who hasn't? Mitchell Hill, okay. So Simon let's um, go for the next game against Mount Eliza, round nine. A nice thrashing that was. 
round nine. One vote, Truey. Yep. Two votes, Curtis Bywaters. We yeah, restart the pyre up halfway through the season. Three votes, Toddy Gardner. There you are, so he's got two best on the ground. Round ten. Jack Francis, one vote. Oh, hang on, you, got to split, you split the votes. Jack Francis and Daly Shannon, half a vote each. No, half a vote. No, hang on. Yep. No, no, sorry, just scrap all that. Oh. Rewind that one. Oh. Curtis, one vote. Looking at, looking at the goal kicks. Right, oh. right. Oh. Jesse Davis, this must be the number That's 55. He can play this kid, I'll tell you, yeah. how you Two votes. Brad Clark, three votes. Well, at this stage, Brad Clark is leading with eight. 10, 12 votes in front of Toddy Garner with 10. So it's pretty, and Jack Francis is. What about Simon Mitchell Hill? Um, how many votes has he got? Well, I haven't heard you call him out yet. No, hasn't heard you call him. Okay, let's go on to round 11. Yep. Daly Shannon, Shannon, one vote. He's one of my favourite players as a kid. Jack Francis, two votes. James Brain, three votes. Okay, not much of a change there, so... Jack Francis, six, he, he's, he's only 18, that kid, too. We've got some very good young superstars coming up, right? Round 12 versus Seaford. Let's have a look at the votes here. Round 12 versus Seaford. Round 12 versus Seaford. Daly Shannon, one vote. Yeah. Toddy Gardner, two votes. B. Clark. Three votes. Early five. Looking pretty good now. Let's have a go on to the move on to the round thirteen. Yeah, move it, move in. Move on to me, yeah. Uh Daily Shannon one one vote. Yep. David Willett, two votes. David yeah, Willett. That's about all he got all year, right? Three votes, Matty Ponton. Matty Ponton, yeah, that was a good game he played that day too, if I remember rightly. Okay, so the next game, which is round 14, uh, which is versus Lang Warren, we have the votes of one vote, Brad Clark. Yep. Two votes, Brainy. Brainy, Brainy, Brainy. Where are you, Brainy? Oh, there he is, James Brain. There we are. There he is. Two votes? Two votes. And three oh. votes, Tony Gardner. Tony Gardner, you're going to win this one, eh? That brings us to the. Round 15 game. Mate, which lad's got a vote? Brad, Brad Clark won. Yep. And Jason Clark with two. And Toddy Gardner, three votes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Holding seven games, Toddy Gardner, it's not bad Okay, so round 16 we have Daly Shannon, one vote. Toddy Gardner, two. two votes. Brainy, three votes. Mr. Brain, 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 Brain. Three votes. Brainy, there he is. So that leads us to round 17, the second of the, th well, well, the they had a bye there, round 18. Yeah. Yeah. One vote, Daniel Arsman. One vote for Arsman. Two votes. Brad Clark. Three votes, Curtis Bywater. Curtis. Yeah, he was sort of in and out the games at last year and really not, too, not very consistent last year, Curtis. So it leads us to the last round of the season. We've got round 18 against the Pines. We've got one vote. You've got half a vote between Jason Clark and Curtis Bywater. Curtis Bywater. Half. Two votes, Brad Clark. And three votes to Toddy Gardner. So that's the end of the voting. While Barry tallies it up, um, uh, while Barry tallies it up, we'll just build the tension. Um, as um, we have a look at, you had Simon Mitchell Hill got no votes. He got no votes. No yeah. votes whatsoever. Where well, he clearly won it on the. Um, I haven't even it. heard of him, but. Um, three, four, seven, ten, twelve. 
So you added up, the, uh, still adding up the votes there. Yeah, so well, Toddy Gard is one of was twenty three to meeting. Brad so we got the winner. We announced we have to announce the winner oh, in a yeah. very very announcing type way, a drum roll type. We have the runner up with twenty one votes is Brad Clark, and the winner of the two thousand and seventeen. Gary Peedling, best and fairest of Chelsea, is... Toddy Gardner with 23 votes. Well, there we have it, viewers. You heard well, it here first. Who were some notable... Well, notables. Jack Francis polled very well. The young fellow, 18 year old, polled 8, 10, 12 votes. Yeah. Uh, James Brown, I thought he might have polled a bit better that, but he only had uh, 9, 11 votes. But they, they, they just... These two got right away from the rest of the field. Right, Toddy okay. Gardner and Brad, and Brad Clark, what's, what's new? I mean, that's, that's, they've done that all the last 10 years. All right, excellent. But Jack Francis, he's a one to watch, man, and the uh, yeah, two best on the ground. He kicked two five-goal tallies, and uh, he's got a brain, football brain, too. So there we have it, um, Barry, and there's some new... We've got some divisional changes, and um, things are looking a bit shaky next year. Um, well, I don't know. Oh, this next next year, I'm not looking forward to it. I can tell you, all these travelling, it's going to be a pain in the left foot. I can tell you now. Mm. And I don't know. I, I rang up Kevin Hall. I was talking to Kevin Hall. I got to give him some money in a couple of weeks' time. So he was. I said, "Can't you do anything? Because he's he's got a bit of clout in him." So, so what we do? You're guaranteeing. Um, you're guaranteeing right now home games. Me? Yeah. Yes. Guaranteeing home games, but it's a bit iffy on the um, well, on the travelling. It's, it's too far to go just to watch a game of football. I remember that. Scores and reports. Well, we'll just have to work something out. I might, uh, I might go with someone else. They might drive, drive. I might go with someone else here and uh, say so taking two cars down. Hmm. Because it's a, it's a long drive, Colin. I'll well, take me play lunch with me. To take your play lunch, yeah, you go for a nap halfway. That sort of stuff. Um, but this is going to be a shock to the system. These people who had the votes for. Uh, yeah. So Mitchell. Mitchell Hill, you gave him the official. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. This will grasp I really gave him a couple of votes during the season. I thought, well, no, I don't think he deserved it, but he did flash in and flash out, Colin. Mm. Pretty flashy. He's but, a flashy but player. He wasn't flashing too much at all. Flash in the pan. No, no. It, well, sort of, not a flash in the pan, but he uh, fade out of the game and sort yeah. of do a few good things during the game. Mm -hmm. I mean, he's got talent. Mm. But I don't know how he's won that special first by 70 votes. It's a bit, bit crazy. I mean, what, what's Toddy Gardner? I mean, uh, that. That's a bit more than I thought he'd get. 23. Yeah, because he had an ordinary season last year, but yeah. that's for him, because yeah. but an ordinary season for Toddy Gardner is a good season for anybody else. All right, so let's um, finish off by the Cheerios, Barry. Yeah, I got some Cheerios, some my little darling, no, oh, PH, PH Shandy, well, that was me. is that my little Cheerios there? No, that's the best and fairest headlines, isn't it? Cheerios. Anyway, yeah, it was only a couple of headlines, to, to PH, yeah. Shandy and Carl. How you going, PH? I might give you a call this week. Yeah. Was he still blocking you? He's got, no, he's got a... No. I, I've, I've spoken to him the last few weeks, and he rang me up. Mm -hmm. But Noz, my mate Noz, he, he tried to ring up Phil a couple of nights ago, he couldn't get through. Blocking. But, uh, he's no. blocking Noz now. <laughs> no, he's, uh, <laughs> but I'll give you a ring the next week or so, Carl. Uh, PH and uh, mm. I'll have a chat and see what's going on. And to my sweet little darling Ning, Ning. she's uh, she's getting better looking every day. I tell you, little yeah. Ning and her little, she, her got, she got all her grandsons and granddaughters right. down there placing them. Right, kids running right. everywhere, and they're gorgeous little kids. Yeah, 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 That's the cheerio to you, sweetheart. Okay, you have a good day, and I'll talk to you later. Okay. Talk to you later. So that just about ends it for today, and of course the 2017 winner, Tony Gardner, with 23 votes. Yeah, and. Uh, not a, not a good season to remember, but uh, you've got to put up with those things, Colin. You can't have the good and bad, but hopefully it'll get some more recruits and yeah. can jump up the ladder. Very good. All right. Well, but congratulate congratulations to Brad Clark again for being runners up again. Excellent. Only well, got two two votes behind. He was. Yeah. So there you go. Hmm. So that's goodbye right. from me. That's goodbye from me. Goodbye from him. See you all next week. Bye bye.